Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Komal Kavar Shekhawat and I am hoping that you all are doing great. So, while running regression or doing any estimation, we usually get stuck on the appropriate leg selection or how to decide the optimal leg length. So, in this video, I shall explain how to select an optimal leg. So, let's get started. So, first of all, you need to import your data file in EVU and afterwards, you need to select all the concerned variables. So, suppose I am dealing with three variables. One is dependent and rest two are the independent variables. So, select all the concerned variables. First, your dependent variable and followed by the independent variables using the control key. Okay. So, these three are the variables in my data set. Now, open these as var. So, var here is for the vector autoregression estimation, right? So, you can see over here the var specification and the var type is standard var and the estimation sample is from 2000 to 2019. Endogenous variables in the model are three. Lag interval for endogenous are 1, 2 and exogenous variable is C. So C here is the constant. So you can keep rest of the things as default and click OK. So EViews has run the vector autoregression estimates over here. Now what you have to do is go to view and scroll down to lag structure. Then there is an option for leg length criteria, right? So select this option and you can see over here the leg specification and the legs here automatically selected by default is 8. So you can keep it as default and proceed with clicking on OK. Right? Now you can see over here the war has used the leg auto selection criteria. Now, in regression analysis or econometrics, there are various criteria that are followed to select the optimal leg length. So, these are LR, which is the sequential modified LR test statistic. FPE stands for final prediction error. AIC is the archaic information criteria. SC is the squads information. HQ, Han and Quinn information criteria, right? Now, you can look for the asterisk mark to follow the optimal leg length criteria, right? So, in my data set, HC criteria and HQ criteria suggest lag 1 to be optimal leg length. Whereas, LR, FPE and AIC suggest the optimal leg length to be 4. Okay, so you can look for this asterisk mark and now you can proceed with the majority. So here the majority is with leg length 4. So this is how I have decided that the optimal leg length for my data set is 4, right? So this is how you can follow this standard procedure to decide the optimal leg length criteria based upon these five suggested that is LR, FPE, AIC, SC and HQ criteria. Okay, so I hope you liked this video. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.